Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make an attachment view. Okay, an attachment view is pretty simple. All it is is a view that attaches to the top or the bottom of another view. Um, this could be useful, let's say, if you want to make like a table of contents or something like that. Let's say we have all these videos here that I had in the last example. And so here we have all of these, and what if we just wanted to list all of them at the top? Okay, so you'd want to do that with an attachment view. The way we add an attachment view is just like adding a view page or a view block. We'll just click this add and you tick attachment. And what this does is just like your other one, it creates a duplicate in this different format. So all we have here is our uh, exact same fields we had before. The only difference here is we have this attachment settings. So we, if we attach this to um, page, we could also attach it to master, but you can attach it to whichever ones you'd like. Uh, page is the other view that we were using before, and it'll attach this, and you can choose whether you want it before or after, um, or both if you wanted to. But we'll leave it as before, just so it's nice and obvious. Okay, and you can have an inherit contextual filters, inherit exposed filters. Cool. We're not going to do any of that right now. We're just going to go in here and change these. So I'm going to click rearrange. And um, I'm going to select this to be this attachment, so it's not going to affect this for any of the other views. And we'll just remove everything except for the content title. So now what happens is it should list out every single title we have. I'm going to go into here, my semantic fields, just to change this. And I'll set this to be, um, with this, I mean, this can just be a, a paragraph tag, just because. Okay, so let's save this. And let's check out our page to see exactly what happens. So as you can see, attached to the top of our view here, we just have a listing of all of the different battles going on. And then here you can see them down here. Great. Well, that is how you make an attachment view. If we were to move this to the bottom, it would be the same thing. It would just show up on the bottom. And keep in mind that uh, you can really do anything you'd like here. So it's not really limited to these fields. You can override any of these. So you can pretty much attach anything, any other view to the bottom or top of any other view, as long as you make it an attachment view. Okay, so that's how you make an attachment view in Drupal 7. If you have any questions or comments, please leave a comment on the video. Hit us up at Twitter, Level Up Tuts. Let us know what you're thinking. Once again, this is Scott, and thanks for watching.